Okay, Cedar, you need to put your hard hat on, okay? You have to keep it on, okay? Oh, oh. Hey friends, welcome to today's episode. So today, I have a really special piece of equipment here, an excavator. And I have a friend named Diego who is a professional excavator operator. Hey! Hey, what's up? Thanks for helping out, man. Oh yeah, glad to help. So while you're helping, can you teach us all about this excavator? Oh, definitely, I would love to. So the special project is, we are gonna use this excavator to move this giant hot tub up over to a special spot. But first, we have some prep work to do on that. And Diego's gonna help us do that with the excavator too. Are you ready to get to work, Diego? Axel's having to get the puppies out of the way so they'll get run over. You don't want to get scooped up by the excavator, do you? Uh-oh, I think we got a problem. Uh-oh, what's wrong, Diego? I don't know if I can fit under this tree right here. This tree is right in the way of where we need to put the hot tub. We're going to put the hot tub right here underneath this awesome tree. But this tree is right in the way of the excavator. What are we going to do about that, Diego? Uh, well, do you have a chainsaw? I do have a chainsaw. Okay. <laughs> well, we could just cut it out of the way. All right, can you cut it down with the chainsaw? Uh, sure. Thanks, yeah, let's Diego. Do <laughs> let's do it. Whoa! Oh, I, I don't Pepper. like it. Pepper's like, this is too high up. Here he comes with the excavator to move the tree, Cedar. Can he do it? I don't know if that excavator's strong enough to move that tree. We'll see. Oh, he just broke it right now. Oh. See, he's using the thumb right there. Hey everyone, Diego here. So the excavator has a big bucket and something called a thumb. And when I curl those two things together, I can use them to pinch and grab something big like I'm doing with the tree. And when I uncurl the bucket, I can let that big thing go. Nice work, Diego! Ah, oh, nice work. Good work, Axel. Axel just cut the rest of that tree off. All right, so now that we have the tree out of the way, Diego can bring the gravel up here for the pad. All right, Cedar's gonna help us. Can you get that branch? Grab it. Can you get it? You got it? Oh, look at that! Cedar's helping! We gotta get all these branches off the gravel, Cedar, yeah. so we don't mix it up. Uh-huh, we don't wanna mix it, the leaves with the gravel. Good idea. There you go. Good work, give me five! Good work! He doesn't know how to give a high five. Another important tool on the excavator is called the blade. The blade allows me to push the ground in front of the tracks and clear a smooth path for me to track on. Now the thing I'm sitting inside is called the cab of the excavator. And the cab is allowed to swing around 360 degrees on the swing bearing. I mentioned the bucket earlier. It's great for pinching and grabbing things, but it's even better for scooping up big piles of stuff like this gravel. That big thing that hangs out over the cab and connects to the bucket, that's called the boom. And that beeping that you hear, that's to let people know that the tracks are in motion and the excavator is on the move. So everybody, watch out. Now the boom, the bucket, the thumb, all of these things are controlled by hydraulic fluid being pushed through cylinders. And there's a massive amount of pressure that's being applied that allows me to push and pack the gravel and move the excavator the way that you see it moving. I'm able to control all of these different parts of the excavator using the joysticks. Moving them up, right, left, down moves all of these parts accordingly.
What do you think, Cedar? Do you think that's big enough? Oh, he's got his mouth full of tree branch. He can't talk very well right now. I'll speak for him. I think that that looks like it's good enough. Okay. I think it looks great. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you did it, you did it. <laughs> Everybody, moment of truth. Diego's about to pick up this giant hot tub with the excavator. Let's see if you can do it. There it goes. Wow. Man, this piece of equipment is super powerful. You took the camera! You took it! So I put Cedar down for just a second to film while we were doing this and he stole the camera! You took the camera, huh? Alright everybody, so we are finally done with this project. Now all we gotta do is fill that up with some hot water and get inside. Oh, yeah, Diego, I just wanted to say thank you so much for helping us. I really appreciate your help here. Yeah, absolutely. I have one more request. Or actually, Cedar does. He told me that he wants to get inside of the excavator there in the cab. Can you get in there for just a second? Yeah, that would be cool. All right, Cedar, you ready? You want to get in there? Buck him in. Okay, there you go. Now you can be an excavator operator. There you go, yeah, grab that one. Uh huh. He's like, but what's back there? <laughs> I want to know what's behind the seat. <laughs> All right, everybody. Well, Come on. let's get that hot tub filled up with hot water and let's jump inside. So I'm trying to get this hot tub to drain so I can clean it out, and there's something stuck in the drain. So I gotta unscrew this and let's find out what is keeping this from draining. Oh, there we go. Okay, so that is what was blocking the drain. What were you doing in there, panda bear? Oh, how's it looking? It's 16 inches. 16 inches. Are you excited about the hot tub river? Yeah. Ready? Whew. It's too hot, so the puppies and the babies will be right here. Daddy, and the potato. Turn off you, the, uh, Axel, turn off the hot Daddy, water. Daddy, can you put okay. cold water in it? Oh, the hot tub is so nice. Mm. All right, so we're gonna let Lupine get in the hot tub. Is that warm? Is that warm, Lupine? Is that warm? See if she can swim to Axel. You wanna swim to Axel? Oh, oh she's swimming to me. Oh, oh good girl, Lupine. Oh, there's Pepper. Pepper. Lupine's time for you. Look, Pepper can hold over the edge too. Good. Girl. No, Pepper just got her sofa. It's been a while since these vlogs had a bath, so it's about time they had a bath. <laughs> so actually, just fun, huh? <laughs> What's that? What's that? Hey, Pepper's getting oh. on top of you. Oh. Well, let's see if she can get. Look at Pepper. Hey, Pepper. Hey. All right. So is everyone grateful for hot tubs? Yeah, and yeah. puppies. Yeah, and and are we grateful for excavators? Yes. Yes. And, and, and what puppies. about Diego? We yeah. grateful for Diego for helping us. Yeah. And puppies. We are so, oh and puppies. Yes, we are so grateful for puppies. Are you grateful for the hot tub, Lupine? She's like, no, of course not. <laughs> I think Cedar's saying he's grateful too. But also we are grateful for you. 
We are. Yeah. Remember, we love you. We think you are awesome. And we are so glad you joined us on today's adventure. Don't just watch our adventures. You get out. We use your imaginations to live your life and love everyone around you. And we'll see you on the next adventure.